Hello everyone, welcome back to more Binding of Isaac Afterbirth, and today I was going to do another challenge, but I think we're just going to do an Isaac run. This is post-patch number one, so there is just a bunch of new items in that should have been in from the start, so I don't need to worry about unlocking more for now. 6W64RJWH, burning basement of course. That's a seed. Let's see if we can find some of the new old stuff that got added back in. That's some skillful dodging right there. <laughs> Also, screw this room forever. Yeah. If I was a little bit faster, that dodge would have worked. Alright, now it's getting a bit difficult. The champion's gotta go. Now oh, we've got two bombs from the champion, that's not bad. And we've got our first item room right here. It wasn't double floor, right? No. So it doesn't matter that I got hit. Good. Daddy Long Legs is good. It's not new, but I'm still going to take it because it's good. I feel like I need just something to support me. So now if I mess up or get a reroll or something stupid, well, actually, no, <laughs> Daddy Long Legs would disappear with a reroll. Never mind. All right, if I accidentally pick up soy milk, we have a we have a get out of jail free. I suppose we literally do now, don't we? Because I unlocked that. Don't know what it does yet because we haven't seen it, but I did unlock something called get out of jail free. If I had to guess, it might be like a trinket where you're not hurt on on sharp doors. That'd be my my guess, unless it's a proper item. I don't know. Also, that item or that trinket idea doesn't exist. That should be a thing. That's a good idea. Oh wait, no. Does Callus already do that for sharp doors? I can't remember. Oh good, it's the haunt. We'll get to experience the bug in patch number one. You might be seeing this after the fix. So, yeah, there we go. Music stopped playing the U1 music. Oh, because I got hit as the second ghost died, I didn't play it again. Also, what is up with this haunt arena so you can't get near him? Not that I want to get near him, but... Yep, so we just have to put up with the U1 music. Even though, also, is he broken? He's not firing. Are you gonna ever... Oh, yeah, okay. I mean, it took you about half a minute, but you did remember you can fire, okay. So if the Devil Duels appeared in that back wall, I'd have to take damage to get to it. Nice! Let's just go. We did get a lot of money there. Hmm, we did, didn't we? Alright, I am going to try and find the shop. If nothing else, it could give me another spirit heart to try and get that first deal with the devil. Also, what's missing on Isaac's post-it these days? Greed mode and hush. I suppose I might be able to get to hush if I go fast enough. You can still miss boss rush and get to hush. It's 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 doable. Obviously the idea was getting to both, because that means you're going super fast, but still. Yeah, I think it is possible to barely b uh, miss boss rush, but still be fast enough. I wish I knew that curse room was there before I got this black heart. And I uh, still get it to... it lives before half hour. Half an hour, rather. I turned briefly American. Our shop has to be connected to here, yeah. A bomb for three pennies. Let's see if I need it. Yeah, I want the map. Plus, the secret room could be right here. It is. Could have even more money. Or the forget me now. That is a difficult one. Thank you for the luck up. Do I do the first floor again just to get more stuff? Or do I reroll it? I'm going to do the first floor again, so that means we don't really need the black heart, so let's waste it going in here. Maybe use a reroll in here if possible? No. That's fine. So we'll be starting the first floor again as classic Isaac. No D6. Which means we're stuck with whatever we get. So what free items do we have? We have... Matchstick, Daddy Long Legs and the map. That's a pretty good start. Am I seriously getting the same one? It's the exact same curse room. It should not be... It's not the exact same floor, thankfully. It is a different floor layout. Alright. So that probably means there's a special room. At least one back here. So let's check this room. Sure enough, both of them are. And a tinted rock. Nice. I'll just take these now. Ah. Bursting Sack Spider Love. I think I did pick this up once before and I'm not sure where it does. If I had to guess... 
spawns random number of spiders when you're hit. That'd be my guess. Bursting sack, that implies it to me. If it does, oh, there's a library, so it's usually the one that's further away from where you started. Unless that's where the shop is. Arr. This could be a chance that Bandage Girl, if Book of Revelations is in there, so definitely use the mother key on this. Is this a pick situation? No, it's books. Book of Belial, fine. Book of Secrets, less fine. Book of Belial is a good pickup, though. I, have, I, I was reading about all this stuff that the patch changed, and apparently prior to the patch, Book of Belial already got nerfed, and I didn't actually realise that. So apparently it's no longer a guaranteed devil deal or deal of some kind if you use it in the boss fight. It still increases your chance, just not as much. Why do they feel the need to nerf things that have existed forever? It seems so stupid. I, I complained enough about that in the, the bonus episode you got probably some time ago compared to when you're hearing this, also why am I not using this? But yeah, really, really stupid decisions. And it's all based on being salty at the wrong people. Childish. Toothpicks is a good item. Let's go down. Also, our face was demonic as hell there. So we're technically three floors deep now, even though the game thinks we're only two. And it's another burning basement. I'm gonna curse room straight away. I think I'd rather fight the boss first. I do want to go in it though. So they create a shockwave, then they spit out an explosion. That's their whole deal. Daddy long legs, you missed. There could be a secret room or two here. Oh, two again, wow. We only have one key and only three cents, so item room it is. That's the friendly fly thing, right? Yeah. I still don't know how this how this one works. Sometimes it seems to do damage, sometimes it doesn't. Maybe you need other followers, something like that. If you know exactly what friendly fly does, feel free to tell me. Because I couldn't work it out enough. This is the second time I've had it. It seems to do damage sometimes, other times it seems to do literally nothing. Look, it's not doing anything there. Bomb the key, nice. And there's our boss. Who we got this time? Ragman! Face my Book of Belial in despair. Also my daddy long legs. <laughs> For a while there, he just wasn't bothering to attack. Well, this could be good or bad, I guess. We're going to do the Devil Deal first, though. Hmm. Yeah, we'll probably take both here. Dart Bomb, the ability to fly. Now, hopefully one of these is a health up. Pray fly. Bad guess. Okay. Well, I guess I'm going into my curse room then. I actually forgot about that. Aha! Uh -huh. Hmm. Secret room there? Secret room probably isn't there, but I'm just checking anyway. I don't want to take half a heart, but can't be helped. Did any red hearts drop? Yes, just outside the boss. Just to try and get back up to three hearts, even if it's spirit hearts now rather than red hearts. But we have dart bombs, so we have a means by which to generate them at least. There you go, buddy. One last pill. Don't be bad trip. Puberty, irrelevant. Oh, we can get in the boss trap room now. Should have realised that when I was down there. Let's go see. I'm only doing it if it's either... Well, if it's gold chest, I still might. I don't know. Let's see. Nah. Not worth it. And we don't have enough for the shop. There is one room we didn't clear. I suppose I can clear it just to see what we get. Oh, easy. And we're going to get some money, so maybe I will go into my shop now. Unless it's counterfeit penny. It's counterfeit penny. Well, I needed a trinket anyway, game, so nur nur. No tinted rock either. Alright, we got another key out of it. That's fine. Still not worth going to the shop. So finally, we're going to leave a floor that is not, or leave to go to a floor that's not burning in some way. Let's go! I imagine, thanks to that forget-me-now at the start, we're definitely not going to get to Hush. But that's okay. Maybe I'll do greed mode as Isaac next, see if the changes really are as bad as some people are implying. Thank you 
for the bomb. Being able to fly this early is a godsend for sure. I do want to go in the curse room, but not until my HP is a little bit better. Nearly. Nearly again. Tarot card. Chariot! Alright. Ooh, this could be very good. Where's the shop likely to be? It could be connected to the next room, actually. Or the item room. Or both. Or neither. That's actually very surprising. So that must mean they're... to the left. There you go, Darbrum. Pay out. Nice. Thank you, Daddy Long Legs. Crush my enemies. Like so. Wow. Definitely don't want to miss the shop. And there's our item room. Uh, you just kill all the momentum in a run, you know that? You're not difficult, you're just annoying. Which apparently is their design ethos, which is really, really bad. A pill we don't know. Health up. I kind of wish it wasn't. That is... that's tech 2, which I don't want. So we'll be ignoring that because it's a massive damage down. And I don't need the infinite, infinite range, not infamous. Although infamously it gives you infinite range. Our boss is there, so our shop is either to the left or through that long room below me. I'll check to the left first. Oh, hang on. Uh, I'd rather have that half heart because that means if I get a deal with the devil, it will be a red heart deal, not a spare heart deal. Ah. No, 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 that's fine. We can, we can take that. It won't trade the deal. Or trade for a deal, I think. Don't know that pill, don't know that pill. Oh, so I think one of those pills might have been a health down originally. Tears down, obviously, really bad. And yes, I'm still playing this while all the, or most of the sound effects are broken. So you won't be hearing health down. You sniping son of a bitch. Very shop. Half PhD. That'd be very handy. The jar and a half price penny. I don't know which one this was. It was puberty. Hooray. I'll buy the key. And yeah, that's it. Right. Oh, there's the curse room. We'll deal with that after this. All right, we got Gertie. It's a bit annoying. Regular Gertie. Daddy Long Legs, you ever want to like stomp her? There we are. Do you fancy doing it again? Oh yeah, we had a tears up, of course. That's why I'm not feeling the tears down that badly. This nub needs to go. Daddy Longleg seems to not be doing that much damage against Gertie. He's fine against everything else. I guess maybe he's, he does less damage against stationary enemies? Also, what made all that poop binder? I forgot to use Book of Belial! I don't think it works either. I can't just like use it and hope to magically get it. Well, that was my own stupidity. I'm not you. I, I know I'm playing as Isaac, so at the back of my mind, it's like I don't have Book of Belial. Why would I have Book of Belial? I'm playing as Isaac. Well, that's my bad. And as per usual, curse rooms are just awful. All right, down to the next floor then. There's two rooms I could clear, but let's try and make back some time in case there is a chance I get down to it lives in half an hour. Or within half an hour, I guess. A magic mushroom would help. Thank you! Now we really will go. Although for Hush, having a big hitbox from being overly large is actually a massive, massive negative. We'll check if this is a special room. It is. Oh, it's a double key room. Hmm. No, I'm not, I don't want to reroll. So all of them are, besides the reroll, garbage. And we've got a. Well, wait, that's a chest room. The dice room is up there. Okay, we will look in here then. Arcano. Curse throws a reroll. Dagaz we'll just use because who cares. And we'll take the Perthra rune up to the item room. 
We've got spiders out of nowhere there, so I think that must be the bursting sack kicking in, but I don't know what triggered it. Here, pull yourself up on them. Thank you. Sad onion, fantastic. Tears up counters are tears down pill very nicely. I don't have enough keys to get in there anyway. I, like I say, I, I'm fine with the way this run is kind of shaping up. What did I give up? Oh, I gave up a chariot card. Yeah, I'd rather hold on to the reroll for something truly terrible. So it is possible we can speed up a bit now. Our DPS is way back up. Pill, do we know it? We do, it's bad gas. Don't want it. Pick up the pill. Still wouldn't mind finding PhD. That would make our pill rotation just amazing. We'd have two health ups in it. We'd have a, we'd have tears up. We'd have oh well, puberty would stay the same. Yeah, we'll take the battery. Annoyingly, we have to go a very winding path to get to the boss on this floor, though. Unless no, the secret room can't be there. No. Yeah, it's a it's a winding path. Don't forget to use Book of Belial this time, even if it's an easy boss. 007. I kind of said that in a Q-esque way. Oh. Ah! How on earth did I miss all those shots? I mean, that was entirely on purpose. I'm a good dodger. Who good this room? Very, very common room. As is this one. Mega Maw. Now I know I have another charge, but Book of Belial doesn't stack like that, so there's no need to waste it. I might as well hold on to it in case I have to fight Krampus. Ugh. So there you go, there's your proof. Book of Belial no longer guarantees deal with the devil. What an awful, awful change that is not necessary in the slightest. <sighs> You know what is worth fixing? All those broken hitboxes you seem to ignore. And those glitches that keep on making people's games crash. Thankfully that doesn't apply to me yet. I've never had the game crash once, I think. Well, definitely not Afterbirth. I can't remember if Rebirth ever crashed for me. I don't think it did. No special room up here, eh? Okay, well, save myself a room. I think we had Fallowed Mushroom for two rooms in a row there. Another waste of time room. We have sped up though. I mean, what is this? This is, well, it's Dank Depths 1. The boss is all the. I'm just going to go in the boss direction. If that means I miss an item room, so be it. Because I would rather like to get hushed, because then next time I can just do a greed mode as Isaac. Oh, look, little dinky one. And then that's his post it note with all the afterbirth content apparently done. At least until they add more time release stuff. Because they're stupid. Thanks for that. Oh, I should probably go back for that key. I mean, I have a double charge, so I might as well speed up this by doing that. Flat worm. Uh, I'd rather have Liberty Cap. For the occasional speed and damage ups. Well, we don't know what we're taking. Ball of Tower, that's fine. And we know our shop's up here, so I haven't actually missed it. Good. Also, this is not Mom Floor. I need to keep reminding myself of that. There's batteries all over the place, so why not? Oh hey, it worked for once. Also, was Dark Bomb away collecting red hearts there? Because he was gone for quite a long time. Maybe they increased his his sense range. The ladder. Fantastic. The compass! Alright. That's actually really good. So we've got map plus compass. It has been so long. I mean this genuinely. It has been so long since I've had both mapping items together. Staggeringly long time. Oh, and then we're going to get Little Gish as well. I wonder if there's a full Gish transformation for having Ball of Tar and Little Gish. Although, to be honest, Ball of Tar it is pretty close to you being Gish. I mean, you might as well be. I 
and we won't know where he's dropped either, so the power throw rune is still not worth it on this floor. That's okay, we can hold on to it. Nothing better. Well, you could make an argument for the chariot, I suppose. But there wasn't that two floors ago. Pentagram, good. Headless baby, not so good, but that's fine. There we go. So the pentagram means we're stronger, that's exactly what I need. We're just behind the clock. How fast do I need to get to the boss? If I, like, if I beeline to the boss, I could definitely get into boss rush. If I find a teleport card on the way to the boss, I will. But it's not boss rush I'm after. It's hush, so I'd rather be powerful. But yeah, we'll fight our way to the boss. Magician card doesn't really help us with the boss. We're not so powerful I'd be comf uh, confident that I'd kill Mom in one minute. Or even like 30 seconds by the time we get there. Even with Book of Belial. <laughs> and that's Book of Belial in card form. Oh good, a bunch of annoying ghosts. I bet Mario says that every time he walks into a mansion. Take that, thank you very much. We use one of our charges in here just to speed it up. Oh, I can make it. I think I could kill her in the time we'll have left. Is, is boss rush worth that? It's not a daily challenge and I've already done it. No, it's not worth it. I'm going to go try and get the item room instead. And the final shop. And the final curse room as well. Please don't make me regret this decision. Well, already I don't regret it. Good damage up from Steven, who just turns up every other run now just to laugh in my face. Uh, Demon Judgment we will play. As best we can, considering where I put him. Goodbye, curse. We get Goat's Head! I am so glad I didn't bother with actually fighting, or getting to and having to fight the new boss rush. I am totally fine with how this is. Oh, I'm not fine with this. Although I kind of cheated. Oh, very common room. The Gish room. No, not the Gish room. They're not Gish at all. Gurgling! Well, this could be Gishy's room. I mean, maybe he just has four pet gurglings. It's perfectly platonic. And certainly not weird at all. Box of Friends! It's been nerfed. Four room charge? Not worth it. Pay to win? I don't think I need that at this point. Ooh, Chaos card. Alright, we're gonna cheese the hell out of um, Hush because fuck Edmund. Alright, good. Oh, this is the thing that gives you the laser tears that I got in the speed challenge. So it's called Tech X. So yeah, now I do that, except I can do little ones if I want. It is an awesome tear effect. Probably my favourite of all the new ones I've found so far. I like that it's variable as well. I'm going to enjoy the rest of this run, that is for damn sure. We'll use Book of Belial anyway, and then we shall annihilate Mom. Really, really easily. You do have to charge a little bit by the way, so although you do do smaller circles, you still have to hold it for like a, a split second, otherwise you don't fire at all. Oh, look at the front of my face. Krampus. Oh, we need to go deeper, eh? Oh, I wish I had my Perthal Rune for that. Oh well. I'll just take it just so I can use it once, maybe get a crawl space. That's fine. Just so I have red, uh, less red hearts. There we go. So, get the hush. That's my only goal. By the way, there is a there's a hush ending that should have unlocked, but it was glitched when the game launched. I got it in the Zazel run I did. To, t to test out his, his nerfs and to try and get to hush. So, after I finish this run, I will go play the Hush ending for you, so you can see it. It's a little weird. Because the first time I got there and beat him since the, the patch one, it played automatically. You also get an achievement for unlocking the blue womb. We'll kill the mini-boss. Oh, Envy, you're, you're so screwed. Glorious. 
yeah, we've got plenty of time, although that said, something might slow me down, so maybe I should kind of assume I don't have a lot of time and just keep going as fast as possible. There's another battery. We'll miss this curse room. We're not going to become guppy this run. We don't need to become guppy. It's, it's fine. All that matters is beating Hush. Even if I die after beating Hush, it's, it doesn't matter. <laughs> no, no, I walked him into it. This room, then one more, but we might as well just make this a little bit easier on ourselves. Oh, there's a giant one there. <laughs> I love the noises of the giant champions, that's fun. And then this room, then the boss. <laughs> there was a mini diglet there. Oh, poor sod, you can't get to me. What a shame, what a terrible shame. X. Not an issue. Actually, no, I was going to say this might make Skolex even easier if it goes like it goes through his body, but I guess not. Uh, eh, kinda. He's going to slow me down a little bit. Still got six and a half minutes. So, we should still make it. Stick your goddamn tail up so I can just end this. I did use Book of Blow, didn't I? I think I did. Stick your tail up. For goodness sake. Prolonging it just to be annoying. Bye. Squeezy. Nice. Tears up so we'll charge faster. Hey, you paid it with an enemy spider, you dick. Krampus. I'm surprised. This might be the first run in a while where I've had consistent devil deals where I haven't had to fight Krampus. We could still get him after Mom. Alright, where are we going? Top right? Oh, all the way to the left. Uh, I'm going to leave the big map up. Just so I have the timer, more so than anything else. I need to make sure I have enough... Don't want the health up. Have enough time to go into the devil deal after it lives. Oh, I let myself get pinned in there, bloody hell. No, not going to take any more pills. I know enough about a rotation. <laughs> Die faster. Go north here. Actually, it's... No, I one less room if I go left. Since I have to do the long room either way. No. Oh, it didn't kill the eye. <laughs> there we go. Daddy long legs took care of it. Bye, it lives. Right, deal with the devil first. We've got four and a half minutes to spare. It's Krampus in a tiny room. Screw you. Goodbye. All right. Let's go deal with Hush. And we get a bunch of free items as well. I don't know if this track played before as well. I think they fixed a broken music track. Maybe that's how they somehow managed to mess up all the sound effects for taking pills and what have you. D4 or Kamikaze, both real bad. In this situation, I mean. Anti-Grav. I'm curious how Anti-Grav affects this tier effect. So I'll take it purely to see if they synergize or don't, as the case may be. Ooh. They kind of... Oh, that's lump of coal making it grow. All right, and grab does nothing to it. And I don't want either of them. There's a tinted rock, though. I mean, the D4 is fine if you want to reroll your run. I don't want to reroll this. This is good. All right, let's go into the win against Hush. Well, his second form, anyway. Also, I think I have infinite range with these tiers. So I can just kind of stand over here. Fuck you! Fart Baby has appeared in the basement. So that appeared on a daily run, so as it turns out, you unlock it by beating Hush with Isaac. And there we go, so he just needs greed mode and then his post it is done. And we took the Polaroid, yes. 
it's weird, but all the achievements for the items you unlock from killing Hush, they don't have the picture of the item, they just have a picture of a blue nub. For some strange reason, I don't really know why, maybe they even forgot. Or it's just not loading properly on Steam, I don't know, but right now it's just got a blue nub. Which is the picture used for unlocking the blue womb. I didn't use Book of Belial on Hush, did I? Not that I needed to, but still. I hate you, Daddy Long Legs. Uh, not the one that's helping me. The one that's not helping me. And straight to Isaac. I can tap fire a bit better now after picking up anti grab, actually. I am the bicycle of death. Make your time. Yeah, Tech X is definitely high on my list of favourite items added. Even if it does look like I've got an iPhone strapped to my face when I face downwards. Alright, let's see what we can synergize with. If anything. Oh, I only have two keys, that's unfortunate. Chocolate milk and the, that's the wizard hat, right? I'm actually curious if that does anything with this. I'll take chocolate milk as well. Yeah, it actually synergizes really, really, really well. Alright, good. If we get more keys, I'll go back. I can now just cover the whole room by standing in the direct center. Well, not for this size of room, obviously, but... Keep seeking eye bullshit. <clears throat> oh! And it turns out I can now tap fire Rings of Death. Interesting. Bird bomb. You didn't really see that heart very well, did you? And we can get another item. Oh! This is... this is going to be good. Actually, the homing effect doesn't seem to be kicking in that well. What is that? Milk, don't cry over it. Alright, so it's a follower of some kind. Oh, there we go, it is affecting... It's, the tears are warping. Alright, I have to tap fire so my hand hurts, but at the same time, this is a very fun synergy right here. Looks like I'm using, like, psionic blasts or something. Also, if there's not an item where you strap a speaker to your face and use psionic attacks, there should be. Yeah, I'm just going to carry on tap firing because I'm doing insane amounts of damage. Oop, there we are. Yum heart. Alright, very easy win. We don't need to worry about Mega Satan in Afterbirth for Isaac because I've already done it, so we'll just easily kill Blue Baby. This is a fantastic tier synergy. One of my favourites that I've seen so far. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. And subscribe if you want to see more daily gaming stuff. My name has been Flick. Until next time, ta-ta for now.